what's up, it's Amos Galpias here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So recently, like a few days ago, I just got a new ukulele and I've never played a ukulele in my whole entire life. I've never played a guitar in my whole entire life. Pretty much, you know, I've never played any sort of instruments in my whole entire life except for the recorder. I used to play this back in when I was in primary school, but it's been a while since I last played it. I mean, I can still play some notes, but I don't think I remember that much of it. Then I decided to pick up a new instrument to maybe learn because, you know, I want to be able to play one instrument the least, and I decided to pick ukulele. Ukulele is quite intriguing, you know, it's just like a smaller version of a guitar, and I really like the Hawaiian sound that it has to it. It just sounds really nice. So today, I'm pretty much going to show you guys my ukulele, and I'm going to go ahead and try to play some songs for you guys, hopefully. Keep in mind, I don't go to any lessons, I'm basically just learning how to play the ukulele off of YouTube, so yeah. Without further ado, here's my ukulele. Okay guys, so here it is, but I don't know if you guys can actually see it, but so this is how it looks like. Here's a better view of it. A mint green colored ukulele and over here it has a little brown handle and there are like the whole tuning things. <laughs> this is what it sounds like. I do know some of the notes, for example, this is C and then this is F and this is A and this is AM and this is EM over here. And I know some of the notes, like the basic ones, I know them. But I don't really know how to play a lot of songs. I just know really simple ones. But I'm trying to learn other songs as well. So yeah. It came inside of this bag. It's a ukulele bag. And there's like some books and stuff in there. And then here's where I keep my pick and other ukulele things like my tuner. So here, this is the tuner that I was talking about. This is the tuner that I use. So pretty much you just clip it to the ukulele and you play one string of it. This is where you clip it like that. And you press this button right here to turn it on. There you go. So when it is the right when it is the right frequency, it will turn green. And if it isn't, then it will turn red. Next thing that I have is this thing, and this is what do you call it? A capo? I don't I don't know. It's a capo, I believe. Yeah. So this thing, you pretty much just clip it the further end of the ukulele so that it sounds more subtle and gentle I guess. So this is the ukulele and this is the capo thing and you just have to snap it right at the front here. Just snap it like that over here in the top of it and then it will sound a little bit like this. Something gentle. The thing that we have is a pick. This is the guitar pick or ukulele pick whatever you want to call it but yeah well, i don't really use the pick that much i prefer to use my hands because i think it's a lot more easier i kind of just like using my hand because it doesn't sound as loud when you use the pick because when i use the pick the ukulele will sound really loud and i don't want to disturb my neighbors so i do just use my hands this one came with two guidebooks which teaches you how to play it and sadly though this is both of these books are in Chinese and I cannot read Chinese. Maybe if they were in English or Malay or Korean, I might be able to read it. But you know, Google Translate is there, so it'll definitely help. But it does have have this, which is all the notes. So like I said, it's C and G7 and F. So thankfully, I can use this to learn the chord, the notes and such. There's a bunch of them, and trust me. <laughs> like for example, this VM7, I've been trying to get a good, a right, the right grip of it, but I just don't know how. How can you, how can one put four fingers on there? To me, it's just quite, it's quite impossible, but you know what, everything's possible. Now, I'm still trying to find an English version of these books. It's pretty much any t English version of ukulele books that I can read and hopefully teach me how to play it. Finally, it comes with this, this end right there, but it's it, you'll see this. This is what you use to wipe the ukuleles. It doesn't get dusty because 
you don't want it, you have to have something like this with the ukulele, so yeah. Hey guys, so that was pretty much my ukulele. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. And if you guys know how to play ukulele, please comment down below and give me some advice and tips on how to play it because I've got no idea how to do it. I just know the chords. Other than that, I really don't know most of it. So please help me. Guys, so I know that I told you guys I was going to be playing this little song for you guys, but I decided not to because I already filmed the footage of that and I went through it again and I just realized how horrible it sounded. And honestly, I'm kind of embarrassed to put that on YouTube. But to be honest with you guys, I've done some pretty embarrassing stuff on here. So, yeah, but still, I just, I'm too embarrassed to show it to you guys because I'm really horrible. So, yeah, I guess that's pretty much it. So, this video is pretty much, pretty much just me showing you guys my ukulele. And other than that, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! You guys, please, I need some help. I need all the help that I can get. So if you guys want to play the ukulele, please comment down below. It'd be really, really helpful. Please help me.